Buccaneer units. In land battles, your buccaneer units are crewmen armed with muskets and are very good at ranged attacks. They can fire at enemy units within four spaces, but are not good at close combat. But not many people know, they are also excellent at making beef jerky. Hello there, I'm AV Storyteller. Thank you for joining me. This is my Let's Play Sid Meier's Pirate. We're going to go back straight into the action and try and track down this Count Montalban. We are... Oh, I'll just quickly show you my status. I'm 24 years old and in good health. I've been at sea for 35 months. My crew of 94 is unhappy. That's probably a bit reasonable, to be perfectly honest. Fleet status. We currently have a brig, uh, the Revenge the Ninth, and another brig as a black uh, vessel called the Black Joke. They're all pretty much fully geared out. I'm really looking for some bronze cannons. That would be absolutely awesome. They allow you to fire more accurately. So it's a bit more forgiving if your ship is a bit off angle with the other ship that you're attacking. Personal status. Here we are. Right, Marquis was English, Admiral was the French, Major was the Dutch, and a lowly captain was the Spanish there. We haven't made friends with the Spanish yet. Once we max out the English rank, then I'm thinking we may change allegiance to the Spanish. We currently have a romance with a beautiful English daughter in St. Kitts. We have just recently rescued our lost sister, and we have gained knowledge about where the Marquis Montalban is which is in San Juan, over here. We are currently in Porta Pax. Pax? Porta Pax? Penny Arcade Incredible Expo? I have no idea. But that's where we are, San Juan. Uh, on the top 10 pirates list, we are number four, the Dread Pirates Roberts. There we are. And I think we're going to get back straight into the action. But before we do so, you need to get the adventuring hat on, because I'm an adventurer, and you need to do these sort of things properly. So... Let's start the music and let's get into the game, shall we? We need to pick up more men. Ooh, pirates attack the city of Ligain. Ooh, and I'll just quickly check my location. So we're going to travel down here and try and pop into a few ports and pick up some more crew because it's going to be a very tough fight. Ooh, actually, let's just pop into the Jesuit mission and see if we can get them to send a uh, amnesty letter to the Spanish. Ah, uh, this is refugees. Um, now, this will basically allow that city to grow in population. So, where should we send that to? Port Royal. On you go. Godspeed. Port Royal? Ooh, can I quickly trade? No. <laughs> Port Royale's got a bit of a funny history. If I can quickly pop up onto the map. Uh, Hispaniol was uh, fiercely controlled by the Spanish. And back in uh, 1654, um, they uh, the English massed a, amassed a massive fleet of 3,000 troops, 18 warships, several like, uh, transport ships as well to capture it. It was an utter failure, complete and utter disaster. So they really couldn't go back to a, a jolly old English saying, sorry, um, we failed. So actually what they did, they went over to where uh, Port Royal now stands, invaded, captured the place, and they set that up as a base of operation, from which they were able to then tack all the Spanish treasure ships and all other Spanish uh, targets of opportunity. Let's go speak to the mayor. You joy in death. I have been appointed the new governor of Lugain. I have big plans for economic growth. Okay, you grow away. Good luck, we're not going in that direction. But if he makes it, then we get a bit of a relationship boost with the fawn. Go to the tavern, hopefully pick up some men. Denied. I thought I already had a silk fencing shirt. Oh no, I had the, the, the puffy uh, fencing shirt. So this is uh, stage two. Loose fit shirt allows quicker dueling moves you can, and can be yours for only 4,200. It's steep, but when you're in a dueling fight with uh, Mon uh, Montabal, you, know, you need every advantage you can get. I will take it. Thank you very much. Let's see if we can get something for. When in the lab. I am very well aware of that. <laughs> Here we go. The bartender scratches his head. The evil Marquis Montalban? I. Last I heard he had left San Juan and was heading in the direction of. Oh, Maracaibo? That's not great. 
that is not great. I'd rather he wasn't going that direction. That's really inconvenient. Okay, let's speak to the ship right. Uh, everything is hunky dory. Um, okay, so if we just ch quickly check the world map, I think we might pop over there just in case he this second just left. See if we and then head down to Maracaibo. But more than anything, we need more crew. That is one battle where you want to get his crew down to in the uh, naval battle, down to one ideally, so the first hit would win you the battle. Now, our crew have just turned mutinous there, so we need to get more money, keep them happy. So I'll just give him a quick broadside. Oh, just out distance us. And I'm just going to try and get into it, wait for it, wait for it. Get into a duel. One, out, try and get him. Okay. And here we go. Rapier, rapier, rapier. We missed the. Let me return the favor. Oh, he's a bit nimble. Oh, I came out of the block far too quickly. Uh, chop to the head. I've waited a bit longer that time. And over he goes. Well done, lad. The ship is ours. <laughs> Still 20 days ago in the direction of Maracaibo. Maracaibo? Kaibo? Hmm, I'll note that in my log. Take all... Hmm, I can always abandon her, but let's keep it for the time being and see how much she slows us down. Oh, I'm going into the wind now. And tack our way forward. Not much over here, unfortunately. Oh, try to avoid the storm. Oh, beach captain! Yeah, let's see if we can pop in here, because ideally I want to pop into San Juan, pick up some crew, but they might fire on me, in fact, I'm pretty certain they will, unless I can get Brother Pablo, Pablo, uh, to San Domingo. And that is in roughly the right direction, that's probably as best as we could have hoped. So let's make that happen. After 37 months, 6 crew. I got off a bit lightly there. With our brig, we are we have very good points of sailing, going almost pretty much north and south, 15 degrees either way. Where is that evil one Taliban? Oh, I will get some uh, quick points here. Yeah, I'm oh I'm trying to turn against the wind captain, and she's not responding to the helm. Okay, so obviously come in for a fight. See how many of these we can get off. That probably be everything. Um, vapor it again. Oh, he looks just like the Count. Oh, he fights like the Count as well. He's not the Count, is he? I'm sure he said Pirate Raiders. <laughs> You're quick, sir, but not quick enough. But it was good practice, thank you very much. The exit's that way. <laughs> Take all, we'll keep her, we'll sell her, and if every gold doubloon counts. Which that was the count now. Come on, Governor. Not Governor. Pablo. Want me to get out and push? 
the little dolphins down there. Oh, another one while we're waiting for our brother Pablo to get in there. And turn! Oh, one went through the sail there. I heard that. And I think we'll just engage. Do, 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 do. That's not my speed. That's what I like to see. Do the head. And either way. Right. We'll take everything, keep them as well, because we're going to sell them all as soon as we get into Santa Domingo. And then we're going to hunt down this marquee. Let's speak to the governor. My dear Captain Ready? Robles, please come in. As you know, at war with the English, capture the pirate's lube, that keeps them a bit happy. Excellent! Man. Congratulations, henceforth ship repairs will be cheaper. That would be very useful, thank you. Oh, 50 acres, we just got enough. Please Rather plain daughter, enter the room. Major Roberts, how nice to see you again. I was hoping you return, however, my generous gift has come to the attention of my fiance, a very je jealous suitor lieutenant, a senior lieutenant. In fact, he has challenged you to a duel upon your next visit. Right, so if you do that, you can basically just leave the town and turn around and come back in again, and you get the duel, and uh, then you'll get some special item or maybe information on the criminal or perhaps even information on one of your family members. Although I, as much as I detest the thought of bloodshed, I do hope you will prove yourself to be a fearless swordsman upon your return. Winning time. I don't know, I've got this rather beautiful girl in St. Kitts. I kind of have my... Anyway, off to the tavern. Excellent. Ten, I'll, I'll take him. Welcome aboard. Large, yes. Salty dogs. Let's have a word with the barmaid. Treasure fleet is heading for Caracas. Okay. Okay, tell me what you know. Fantastic. That's useful. Excellent. Left San Juan. Oh. Same as before, same as before. Special dueling skill. High chop. So, we'll have to be mindful of that. Uh, merchant. Oh, okay, you, you can have my sugar. He did. Uh, we don't need that much food, so we'll get 12, down to 12 months. You do lose some uh, guns in a ship battle, so you don't want to have just the minimum. You want to have a few spare just lying around the deck in case you need them. Uh, ship right. Right. Repair the revenge. Repair the black joke. Trade galleon will be selling. Yeah. And uh, soup of war. A good set of stuff. Soup of war are very tasty. I might just keep on. What of your upgrades? Well, you're go you've got the less, so I'll sell you. Repair you. I think on my ten crew I just picked one now I'm going to be sailing that but it's, I just like having two spare call me crazy nine nine right okay what I'm going to do is head actually towards San Juan and then turn around and start heading towards Maracaibo because I just want to make sure that he's not in this small stretch of ocean because if I get all the way to Maracaibo, I'm always going to be thinking, was he just, just around the corner? Was he just around the corner? And it will drive me insane. So, we are there. Oh, 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 why are you? Why are you? You're in such a hurry. Ah, trade galleon. So we've got pirate raiders. We'll have a go at you anyway. Very suspicious of a fast moving ship. Mutinous crew, you're just in time. Uh, 
are twice as much crew as me, so let's soften them up a bit. One more, and I think we'll go in. And turn around. Rapier, please. I'm a bit dizzy. Over he goes. Just when the battle is starting, I always tend to just be uh, wary of the thrust, because that's always the fastest of all the three attacks. That's the one I'm watching out for. And when you don't know how fast your opponent is, I'm always ready with that parry. That's got priority. Okay. Um, no, I think we're going to have to sink her. Oh, 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 denied. Every ship I see now, I think it's a marquee. <laughs> we'll pop in here, get some crew, and then swing our way around. Maracaibo. Talk to the governor. Probably not gonna have much to say. In blue gratitude. Of course, if it's a pirate sloop, we did. Ah. We need Goodbye. Taverns. <laughs> we'll take them. Thank you very much. <laughs> Tell me a bit of Santiago. I'm kinda of going a bit quicker through these now, now that we're a few episodes in. I can slow down if people would prefer that. Uh Baron Mondo ship has been upgraded with copper plating. That helps them uh, turn quicker. Alright, Roughly in the same direction that we're going. Awesome. Okay, merchant. Give me a few of them. Ship right, everything should be fine. Yeah. Sail away, sail away, sail away. So I'm gonna go around this side of the island. I oh, see that crew is mutinous. We're going to go around here, and he was in where was he again? Yeah, Mount Kaibo, Dalaway. <laughs> captain, we've been sailing for over 39 months with only 28,000. I'm the captain, get back to your duties. There'll be plunder on the way, gentlemen. Fear ye not. Okay, we're picking up speed now. Yeah, the term buccaneers actually come from the French word boucan, uh, which was a type of cage that they built over fire fires in order to cook strips of meat, basically beef jerky. And uh, the people who did that were basically uh, maybe ex-criminals or the, the, the down and out from Europe who would manage to you know, get on board a ship, work their way over to the New World. And uh, they would sell this, these strips of meat to um, the soldiers and the other sh uh, ship members that would be passing through. And uh, they were a rather enterprising young bunch, so they would um, sometimes occasionally steal ships as well. Uh, so these Bukans actually got the name Bukaneers, um, who the men that sold the beef jerky. Uh, and so occasionally they would actually steal ships, become pirates. And uh, the uh, Europeans, both Spanish and Dutch, did not like this. And so all the animals that there were on this island, uh, that they were cooking their meat from, they would go around and actually kill all the livestock. And of course that's their livelihood. These Bukaneers' livelihoods had gone away. And so they turned to piracy <laughs> in order to you know, survive. So the Spanish who were killing all this livestock to try and stop these uh, buccaneers actually arguably created pirates and created an even bigger problem for themselves. We shall go on. Let's actually pop in here to Kareko and sort them out. 
new warship. And go. See if we can pitch up, pick up some more crew. Talk to the governor. Do, 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 do. My dear Mr. Roberts, please come in. English and the French. Excellent. Colonel. Of its merchants will trade more goods in Dutch port. Typhoon gear droid. Ah, okay, so we're going to get a special item or uh, info on Baron Raimondo. Either way, it's good practice. But when we get uh, the Dancing with the Beautiful Daughters, it can tell us the location of the marquee. And I've got calfskin boots on last time, remember? Hope I've remembered to put them on for the dance. I don't want to say how well this is going because you just know <laughs> what will happen. Maybe it's a bit slow one, but I got it. Oh no! Oh, your boots don't fail me now! Oh, I got away with that one. I don't think she noticed. Fantastic. Yeah, she is loving life at the moment. Phenomenal. So that was a good, not a perfect, that was a good. Okay, excellent. Right, the Corsatina is a crucial item. It improves morale on long sea voyages. It's a second tier of the three-stringed fiddle. Uh, pre precision barometer it helps you against storm damage. Uh, Brace the pistols. It's a second pistol. Call this fly, guys. Yeah. Um, the bottom Brace the pistol Corsatina are excellent choices. That's a nice to have, and that's a nice to have. I think I'm going to go for the concertina to try and improve my uh, crew's morale. Apparently, this instrument improves crew morale on long, on long voyages. I'll take it. Thank you very much. Zilla. Please come back soon. I look really forward to hearing more of your daring adventures. Right, that was superb. That went very well. Let's go to the tavern. Pick up some more skivvy dogs. Welcome aboard, man. <laughs> Now this will guarantee an invitation to the ball, but we don't need it. Bamit, add you warmly. Congratulations. Oh, you just know he was flexing when she was stroking his shoulder and arm there. It works out. That's right. <laughs> right, okay. Last hold up in Rio de la Hacha. They love that place. Right. Excellent. Let's go sort him out. Mm, check the ship. What did I do with my sloop of war? I have no memory what... <laughs> no memory what happened there. Where did my sloop of war go? Did that get sunk? Did I lose it on rocks? I miss her. I'll find out obviously when I re-watch re this. Odd. Odd. Do, do. Right. Let's sail away, sail away. And so we're just going to follow the coast around. Oh, these are not mutinous anymore. East Rotterdam. Transport a new governor. We'll have you. You just know that governor is going to take all his wealth with him. Yeah. 
Yep, excellent. Take all. We'll keep her. We can sell her on the way. Come on, wind. Come on, wind. Quick check of the map. We are here. That's that's where we're going to. So yeah. So we'll just go straight ahead. Straight ahead. Mind the box, lads. Who have we got here? Who have we got? Trade, trade, trade. We'll pick up a bit of trade while we're at it. Oh, she's struggling against the wind. Right. See, I'm trying to turn right here. Oh, she's not responding to the helm. Turn. Almost evenly matched in crew. That gives us a teensy bit of an advantage. That's just yelling that. And two to the head. And back at you, sir. Over you go. Bottom lads. The ship is ours. Okay, but let's just check the map for where we can... Might not be able to sell them anywhere apart from Rio de la Pacha, which they may not let us into. But we'll have the option to uh, abandon them if necessary. Just give them the one door side and we'll just fire straight in. Why not let him g give them another shot? Oh, lovely. Nice. I could have went for a cup of tea in the time it took you to make that swing, sir. Have a think about that. <laughs> Well done, lads. Do, do, do. Okay, I think I'm going to have to sink this one. Pop into the pirates. Oh, I should have just kept that. So you just sold it to the pirates. What were they thinking? Never mind. Talk to the captain. Ah, oh, Maracaibo, Port Royal, Goat. Maracaibo, you head in that direction, but I'll just jump them as soon as they come out. Bit of the tavern. Excellent. Welcome aboard, lads. Tell me more, tell me more. When in the lab. Pretty quiet around here. Pizza. Still hold up, excellent. Right. Let's speak with them. Oh, zero gold. That's not good. You always get terrible prices at a pirate haven, but I might have to sell them something. Because I'm going to have to dump 47 tons of cargo anyway. But we can sell that without any problem. Better to get something than nothing, eh? Oh dear. Can't sell them anything. Hmm. Let's have a look at the map. Is there any more piratey places along the way? This is where the Dutch and the Spanish rutter would help you out with these little towns. Okay. Doesn't appear to be. We'll uh, chance it and just keep hold of them for the time being. Having crew mutiny. What did I forget to do? Because I'm so focused on the marquee at the moment, I've just got tunnel vision. Whoa, whoa, steer, steer! There he is. There he is. Okay, fleet status. 54 crew. Right, I'm just going to abandon you. No, nope, just do it. Get a bit more crew in my ship. 
So reef the sails. Oh, actually, what's the time? Thirty minutes. I this could go. This could this could be a long sea battle. So I'm going to cut it here. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Obviously, join me for the next one where we uh, attack the the, the marquee and hopefully uh, get some information regarding um, family, lost cities of gold. You know, awesome stuff. If anything else, we'll just revenge ourselves upon him. So, I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, take care of yourself and goodbye for now. Goodbye.